Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles's son, Wenceslas IV. Wenceslas. His father had prepared him for this moment all his life. Huh. I've always wondered how to pronounce but that. Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. Oop, I think I saw a boob. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor. Look how sad that dude looks. To endear him to the Pope. Yeah, that's a Schweinhund. Did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Sigismund. Ah, oh, Sigismund looks like a. Sigismund douche. decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. I love how the he dude in the blue helmet Bohemia behind the king there, or Sigismund, looks really high. Pillaging the territories of the king. You see the dude in the blue helmet in the background? He looks high as shit. It is here that my story begins. <laughs> Do we get to go to the main menu now? Yes! Hi guys, Vex here. Welcome to Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, holy crap. Okay, so I have played this game for six hours just to learn the basics and not be a total derp because I figured the viewers would appreciate that. That six hours is how long it took me to get out of the prologue slash tutorial section of the game. Holy crap! That is... Nuts! But I was totally immersed and engaged in it the entire time, and I thought it was amazing. Um, this game looks incredible. Uh, so, I'm going to start a new game, and uh, I, I, I showed you that starting cutscene because it's pretty important. Um, so, the basics is, we're in Bohemia, the king died. The king's heir inherited the throne, and he's kind of like a lazy oaf that the nobility doesn't like, so the, a group of nobility conspire to basically do him in and kidnap him and put the Sigismund guy as the new king. And that is what kicks off the Civil War and is the main plot point in Kingdom Come Deliverance. We are in uh, what is now modern-day Czech Republic, I believe. But the game, I think, takes place in the year 1403, I think. Um, anyway, uh, so settings are already pretty much set up. I was tweaking some, uh, we got the subtitles turned on for you guys. Uh, I'm going to turn up the, uh, voice volume and turn down the sound volume and down the music volume. Okay, cool, yes. Alright, so I'll, I'll try not to talk over the cutscenes, um, anymore. Uh... Yeah, okay. Let's let's get started. I cannot wait to do this for real. Uh, so I'm going to start a, a fresh new game, and we'll start from the winning. I will try to get through the tutorial now that I know what to do as fast as possible. But I can finally tell you guys... I was kind of focused on the mechanics this time. I'm getting more and more in the story. Um, I'm going to just overwrite this. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm excited.
game is so friggin' pretty. Reminds me of the opening to Oblivion, panning around the castle. This game tries to be historically accurate fairly well, by the way. Down well, to the husband, clothing how and goes it? Good. Outlook of I the characters. Get it finished today. Stuff like that. Where on earth is Henry? <clears throat> I need him to run some errands. Like all good protagonists, I, I am asleep. At this hour, blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, <laughs> drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. <laughs> Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. And there's me in bed, asleep, being lazy. Henry, mm. get up now. Yeah, I can identify with this character. There's work to be done. Uh, I'm the protagonist of an RPG. Yeah, I don't want to get up. Get eh. up Hear that? You'd better not vex him. No, vex me. I'm vexed. Now get up it's quick. Me. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Uh oh. Have you been? Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself, is all. <coughs> mm, well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. Mm. Oh. <coughs> oh, yep, yep. Getting up. Fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? <laughs> I was with Bianca. <laughs> so this is kind of your character customization, your choices here. Um, yeah, I was I was with Bianca. I was with Bianca. We, we were um, talking. Talking. <laughs> talking, were you? That's what you call it, is it? Mm -hmm, yeah. Stop it, ma. Yeah. Yeah, that's what you call it. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Oh, uh, fine. Matthias is teaching me archery. So last time I said I was with the Bianca again, but it didn't give me any increase that I could see. Maybe it did. Uh, but I, I definitely have a taste for archery. Um, I like shooting things. Funny, huh? Uh, man, I wish I had a gun. It's 1403. When do we get the first hand cannons in Arquebus? Like the 1500s? Damn, I think I'm 100 years too early. Unless I move to China. Ah, well. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go archery. For agility. No, it's just... Matthias was 
teaching me archery. Archery? Do you want to become a poacher? Have you any idea of the punishment for that? And where did you get a bow, anyway? Oh, come on. I've no interest in poaching. It's just a bit of fun. Oh, Christ, give me strength. Just don't do anything stupid. For the love of God. Promise. I promise. Yeah, I promise. Uh, so, you need any help, Mum? Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, uh, you're a good lad. Yeah, I'm a, but I'm, I'm a fine. good boy. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. Yep. Uh, and my friends come around? Actually, not. They have not. I already know the answer to that. Um, is Dad angry at father me? Father angry with me for sleeping late. He's not happy. Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. I know people like that. he needs your help, Henry. I know. My stepfather's Don't a lot like Mark. that, I think. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope there Oh, yep, yeah, there's a storm coming. It's looking like such a nice day. I'm hungry. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. I'm going to be a typical yourself. indolent teenager. Give me food. I want to sleep. Food, sleep. Food, sleep. Food and sleep. All right. Um. So last time I looted the house and spent some time doing that. I don't really need to. Uh, I'm going to take a piece of cheese. Oh, yeah, that cheese. I want that cheese. Yes, cheese. Um, and I'm just going to go ahead and, like, eat. Eat from the breakfast pot here. Alright, hunger debuff has gotten rid of. Let's go out here and Let's sprint. The controls in this game took took some time getting used to. X is jump, and I thought maybe they'd copy Skyrim and make Y be jump, but instead Y is call your horse, and A is use, and then B is sprint. So, yeah, if you're used to Skyrim, um jokes on you, I guess. Um, I'm going to sprint everywhere because I want to train up my help. athletics. Yep. Hi, Dad. At least you're up. That's a start. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? Pommel? I'm running out Cross of charcoal. Yard, charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal <coughs> burner. Cool. I'll charcoal. Money, Got it. Then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for oh, axe, a hammer and the nails I sold. Kunesh sounds like a real bum. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Yep. Kunesh. Not drunk. Crack my knuckles here. <laughs> That'll be fun. Oh yeah. Uh, big lad now. I'm, sure I'm gonna tell him to pay manage. up with my fist. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself. Actually, my first time through here, he kicked my ass. So. This time I'm, I'm hopefully better at fighting. Sure, I'll be happy to hear it. By the way, this game no, does not hold not your hand. The in the prologue slash tutorial, I died a lot. Sword, which I had engraved in Sasau. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on Money, your way home. Money, charcoal, cross guard, oh, ale. Anyway also, go hit on my girlfriend. Girl and maybe find Make sure the house. ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. I gotta be honest, I kinda like Teresa better. Um, we'll meet her in a, in a bit. Alright, uh, so... My lads are up here, hey lads. Some friends. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzig, and the Chamberlain has the crossguard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. So the Chamberlain's kind of like a... The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. ...a day-to-day -day manager of the castle. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. And did I ever botch anything? <sighs> Where shall I start? Oh, no. Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. I really love how laddish Henry is. He, he's he's maximum lad. Magnificent. 
Seems he's really, he's really likable. Well, I better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Unlike Skyrim, you don't get to make your own character. You you play as Henry, and that's that's it. Uh, but thankfully, I really like Henry, so we're good to go. Now, this is a game by a smaller developer. It's not a AAA title, so I'm very impressed with what I've seen in the game so far, what they've been able to accomplish with the resources that they have available. Um, and it makes sense why there's just, you know, you're Henry and that's it. It also means that uh, you get to have a more focused narrative, where in Skyrim it's the, the plot has to be very generic for you, because you could be anybody. There's a sheep over there. I should run over there and, like, harass the sheep. Now, wait a minute. I can do that anytime I want to, on account of me being in New Zealand right now. Um, yep, I'm filming this in New Zealand. Hi from south uh, south of the equator. It's summertime here right now, and it's, it's actually quite hot here, so I have a fan on me in the background, so I hope you can't hear it. Strange and ill um, But since I serve our liege lord, Sir Radzik, I think you know the answer. True! But where will Sir Radzik take right. this? He looks like he's busy, so I'm going to go to his assistant to talk about the charcoal. Hey! God be with you. God be with you too. Uh, so I need to buy ten charcoal, and it's oh, okay. So I need to come up with like five, uh, five doohickeys of money. Grush, Grushnig? It's called something. All right. Pretty sure I don't have that just yet. We need to get the money back from um, from douchebag McDrunken debt over here. Actually. I think before we do that, why don't we talk to this guy who wanted to train hey, me? Hey, do you want to learn something? Yep, let's do this first. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do I you just, want? I just, I want to explore the world in this hole forever. and... I need to learn some self-defense because there's bandits on the road, the yo. The world's a dangerous place, and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken That's right, Henry. Man. Hell yeah. Happens, Nothing wrong with learning how to defend yourself chance. and acquiring the I weapons to, to enact so, that. Are you ready to get stuck in? <clears throat> yes. Hell yeah, let's do this. All right. I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. So I'm doing this first because actually fighting the drunk guy, I had a really hard time with it, and I would love to try to pick up some some experience here. That maybe, uh, maybe it would help me. All right, I'm well, I'm gonna run on up here. Are you coming? Would it kill you to jog, dude? All right. So there's a lot of grass in this game. I hope the bitrate on YouTube keeps up with it. Um, this looks really freaking good on my computer. Running on a GTX 1070 at 1080p. I've heard of some people complain about occasional areas of the game where there's a up and over uh, performance hiccups, but you know, I have yet to see any of that myself. Shippies, shippy shippy, hello, hello. I should take one of you guys home with me. Give you to my wife. Women love sheep. They're nice and floofy, and you can make clothing out of them. Not out of the sheep, but out of like the wool after you shear them. Oh, I have to talk to you. Bloody hell, man! Come on. Hey, watch it. Sorry. So, can we get started? Yeah, I would love that. I'm kind of trying to we go can't. hurry this along because I'm trying to Good. do this in like and less than six hours. The last nice. time we'll be seeing each other. You can show me everything I've taught you so far. All right, let's do this. Very well. Let's start with the basics. Can I use my fist Keep instead? Moving. Your life depends on it. I would love to like kind of cheat and pick up some levels of uh So, uh, I want to unlock for my opponent and hold right, B to run right. around. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. So will will the game let me use melee here? 
No, I, I think the tutorial wants me to use the sword. All right. Hup. Yeah, maybe try a nice jab. Oh. No, it, it won't even let me jab. It wants me to slash. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. Yeah, it wants me to specifically do these things and. Good. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Alright, so let's come in. Uh, you gotta think about this really fast in actual combat, but thankfully he's just gonna sit there and let me think for a second. So I'm gonna try uh, left, right, down, stab. Alright, let's get our stamina back. Uh, let's do left, golf swing, up, come in with a stab, down again, left again, stab, golf swing up. I don't know what to call the ones that come up from the bottom left to the bottom right, but it feels like swinging a golf club to me. I didn't really pick up any experience there, damn. Okay, well... Alright. Let's go... What are we at? 20 minutes? There's no way I'm going to be able to accomplish anything in this game in 20 minutes. It's just not one of those games. So I think the episodes for this game are probably going to be in the 30 to 40 minute mark. Um, I know a lot of people prefer like 20 minute YouTube videos, but that's just the way this game's going to be, I think. Alright, um, let's go get to this drunkard fault. And hope for the best, I suppose. Hey, buddy. Hey. Uh, maybe I can actually speech him this time. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Pay for the tools, at least? You know you owe Father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. Alright. Alright, so you've basically got a few dialogue stats here. The first one is the mouth, it's just plain speech. Um, the heart with a crown is uh, kind of like a uh, like a nobility type thing, you know, where if you look the part and you're well spoken, people respect you more. Uh, the swords is more of a threatening approach to dialogue, and then there's also just plain old bribing, <laughs> and then and then special case dialogue. And so basically, uh, basically your your opponent in the discussion has speech, nobility, and like might stats. Yeah, okay, speech, charisma, and strength is what they're actually called there. So speech, they have speech, charisma, and strength stats for dialogue, and so do you. And you pick the route, the ideal situation is you pick the one where you're the strongest and they're the weakest. That's the basic strategy. Um, so I don't know much about this dude. And my nobility is at seven right now, but the thing is, is, yeah. All right, now last time I threatened him. Um, let's just try speech this time. It's my weakest stat, but maybe he's weak in it too. Um, I don't know much about Kunish, so you can see the his stats are in question marks because I don't know what his stats are. Look. I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off, booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. 
You son of a whore. Nope. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Yep, alright, I gotta fight him. Oh. Alright, let's attack. Come on from the right. Nope, he's gonna hit me first. Yeah. Alright. Now, I, it's okay oh. to get hit with bare fists as long as your stamina's up. You'll die for that! So, the, the interesting thing here is that I uh, use my yeah. stamina, so I think I blocked that. Ah. Oh. Ah. So, I actually use my stamina to attack, and ah. then... I also like use it as a, sh a form of a shield, basically, over my red HP bar down there. So right hook, <laughs> left hook, jab, uppercut. Did I hit him? Oh, I leveled up. All right, block, 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 block. Oh shit! Oh, get off me! All right, let's give him a kick. Oh, 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 I'm in danger of losing oh, HP. Oh, shit, I lost some HP. Okay. All right, we both lost HP. Oh, All right. God. Left hook, right hook. Oh, damn it. He does this grapple thing to me, and I'm not sure what hap happens there sometimes. Like that right there, he just grabs me. Yeah, but. All right. I have the high ground, at least. Ah! Take a hit from that shit. Yeah, this guy's tough. I've seen I've seen forum post of oh man, look at that. Just nailing me. I've seen forum post of this guy, like people having trouble with him. And now I'm in a tree and I can't see shit, so I'm actually gonna turn and run for a second. Alright, come on you little bastard. Oh, he's still, he's still there. Oh, ah. shit. Oh. Ah. Just trying to get my stamina back. Ah. Oh dear, did that hurt? A bit, yeah. that? What is he doing to me? I think he's... he must be a much higher Come level in uh, unarmed than I am, because I don't know whatever he's doing. Yeah, that right there. I don't. I, my character never does that, and I'm still unsure. Oh, right, I'm gonna kicked. Although I mean, it seems like a good, good chance to uh, level up, if nothing else. God damn it. You had it coming, you pup. And your old man can fuck off too. I'm not sure why I immediately lost there. I guess it, I guess I lose if I get too low on HP. So this happened the first time as well. I basically just you run back to your mom <laughs> and she patches you up. Hi, Mom. Got my ass beat by a stupid drunk guy who's higher level than me. Right. Huh? Yes, 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 yes. There you are. Good. Thank you. Yep. All right. Ah, I feel much better now. Um, I kind of want to go back and fight him again. I, 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 it's fun just fist fighting this guy. Where'd he go? You 
You know what? How do I ready my fists? Wish to punch. What is it? Yeah, I ambush you. I just run up and start punching you. Or okay. What the fuck is that? That's gonna cost you your life. I don't. I just realized. I don't. It doesn't matter what way I want to attack from. They're all grayed out. Only fists only go to the head, pretty much. So I probably want to jab and then kick, and then come in with a maybe another jab. Jab. Now, now. For stamina. He's at half actually. I just realized you don't have a mom to heal you up, do you? And the guards just like, yeah, whatever. These guys are having a fist fight. I'm taking all of your. I'm repossessing your clothing. Don't worry, dude. Just debt collection. Nothing to see here. Oh, that's that's so fat satisfying to beat him. Get the hammer. Get the nails back. All right. Let me eat your food too. Yeah, fuck you, Kunish. Did you get y'all drunkard? And now I am going to go sell your crap for money, and then use that money to buy the charcoal that I need. Hello. Hi. Let's trade. All right. Um, I got myself some. Maybe in the other tab. Let's see here. Oh, that's no. I want to go to sell. Uh, can I sell this? The dark foot wraps and soles. Can I sell this clothing? Just sell all of this stuff. And this cheese, too. I don't, I'm not going to need this cheese. There we go. I like how my, my scarf is broken now. Uh, I'm not going to bother haggling. I'll just take what I get. This stinks to high heaven of stolen goods. I'll buy it, but it won't pay much. As long as we can both agree on the price. Oh, oh, interesting. So she's not giving me as much because it's... Oh! Oh, that's a cool system compared to Skyrim. Oh my god, look at me. Will you give me 24 for it? Since it's you. That sounds pretty interesting. A little less and I'll be satisfied. Alright, we'll come halfway. Very well. I agree. Um. Hey, Kunish, I just sold your, sold your crap. Enough! Enough! Oh. I give up! Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? Uh, I what the hell? I feel like that was a. That should have happened earlier, but okay. I'm, I'm ahead of you already, Quest. I appreciate it, though. Alright. So. Uh, now to go get the charcoal. Let's talk trade. I need ten of these. Cool. Charcoal done. Uh, next up is to go get the ale. Um... Ale. Don't be with you, Henry. Laces, come, people, come. 
Now, there's an optional thing here that I think I might skip this time just in the name of uh, you can't be serious. moving the LP Insulting along. Our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitors. Now even the Pope God be with is you, Henry. To your king. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Kutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? You're too old, right, Matthew. You should give him a proper hiding. <sighs> Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlementure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. Yeah, we, we throw shit at his house. We, we literally we just fling poo at his house. Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But, doing some tears all day. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Radzik's sword. Come on. Throw in a few handfuls. Look how crappy my clothing looks there. now after and fighting it's our duty so much. To defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? No. Um, okay, so what happens here is if I say yes, I literally just go throw shit at this dude's house. And then we run away from the guards, and then that's it. And then they helped me, uh, they helped me beat up the drunk dude later when I first did this and, and couldn't really handle it. So... No. No, I'm gonna pass. Not that I don't want to teach the Deutsch a lesson, but I really don't have time. Well, that's disappointing. Still, we can manage without you. Let's go, lads. Honestly, hell. How could you pass a good chance like this? Be back in two shakes. Bianca, hey. Well, save my lovely. You're looking well today. I'm not. <laughs> you too, handsome. Oh, thank you. What brings you here? You do. Your beauty, of course. <laughs> I'm in there, guys. I'm in there. Oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? A uh, pitcher for father. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. I learned Pope Benedict XIII. Excellent. Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening, I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. 
<laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyan? I suppose. He is a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of That's it. That's the guy who was teaching me I'll be sword happy play. when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, Savior Schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Hell yeah. Hal's got He's like, yeah, I will. Lacing around the tavern again? Have you nothing better to do? Not right now. No. What is the oh, problem? I haven't seen this. I hear you've been spouting nonsense about the king again. Do you want someone to poison our livestock? Have you no sense at all? Come home and stop disgracing us. But I said hardly anything. So, dude's house is over here. Did they throw poo on it? Yeah, they did. Yep, they've already thrown poo at it. Mishik, what are you doing? We don't have to run. We on the right. Ah, yes. Sorry. It's just that yep, Never they pooed his house. Hey, dude. Help to you, Henry. I kind of, I'm, I'm going to see, what, do they react to this? Because I've never seen this situation where I said no and I'm not involved. Last, last time I did this, I was the one throwing poo. Nope. Okay. Alright, let's get out of here. It is 42 minutes in. And... We still have a lot of tutorial left ahead of us to get through. Um, but isn't this cool? Like, I tweeted about this and I said I said the word tutorial, but I mean, it's really... It's the prologue. I should have said prologue. Because some people said they didn't like tutorials and that a game should just teach you as it goes. It's basically what it is doing. Um, but yeah. Uh, next episode, I am going to return this sword to my father. And uh, things are going to get a bit uh, heated, you might say. Until then, this has been Vex playing Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, if you like my content, please check out my Patreon page listed below. And I will see you guys next time. Until then, as always, take it easy. <laughs>